วัสดีค่ะ Welcome back to Bim's Kitchen. This is my second time making rye bread. This time I add about 20% of bread flour into this uh, recipe because last time when I make it, uh, it's very dense and uh, difficult to eat. As I never eat rye bread before, so I trying to make something that you know is more uh, familiar for my taste. So all the ingredients I will write it down for you, so you don't have to listen uh, or write it down the amount that I uh, gonna say. So after I put uh, all everything into the uh, wet in uh, ingredient, I sift the bread flour and rye flour together and uh, mix into the wet ingredient a little bit by bit. So all together. This is about 85% higher hydration. So it very, very wet though, especially when you're working with rye flour is, is very sticky, very sticky though. So I use my uh, equipment to uh, help. After I mix, I just let it proof for about six hours in the cold a cooling box with some ice pack in it. This is six hours after I leave in the box. So it's rise up quite a lot. And then I put them into the fridge overnight. This is uh, in the fridge overnight, it's rise up a little bit. I can feel this very light in my bucket. So we're gonna shape it. So what I'm doing here, I just uh, put some flour in uh, on the counter and then I just uh, uh, put the dough on. A, uh, you need to use a lot of flour. So I use my bench scraper to uh, fold them together and then I turn over and use my hand to make it round shape. So I put a lot of flour on top of my rye. And I gonna use a butter. This time I use a bread bread sling. My friend give it to me. I will put uh, the in the detail of bread sling for you. So I use Dutch oven this time. I preheat the Dutch oven. The reason I use bread sling is it's easy to remove the uh, bread, uh, the dough from the uh, basket into the uh, Dutch oven. So after I bake about 30 minutes, I open the lid and you can see there inside my rye bread start to baking through. And I just continue baking until they're nice color. This is finished. See the magic of bread sling. It is very easy to handle. I will put the link for you, whoever want to use the bread sling. Uh, Cliff, my friend, gave it to me so he can help you to find it. This is very good equipment for whoever use Dutch oven. This is my rye bread look like and I serving with smoked salmon and cream cheese. I'm telling you this is so delicious. And some of you told me this is a work, but I don't know it's kind of flat bread. It's look really fat to me, but it's worth. Thank you.